Team Picnic from the University of Colorado Boulder presents an update on progress for the Amazon Picking Challenge. Here we pick four products in a row using Baxter in hard-coded product locations. We demonstrate motion planning, calibration, grasping, and control in our robot agnostic framework. Our overall approach is based on the Move It paradigm, using probabilistic motion planning combined with an internally developed, experience-based planning approach, Thunder, that increases the speed and reliability of motion plans. Thunder allows for rapid recall of low-cost solutions suited for cluttered spaces that contain narrow passages. We have been developing and exploring several different end effector options for the competition using embedded sensors that provide feedback for typical manipulation tasks. Shown here is a Yale Open Hand Model O demonstrating both pinch and enveloping graphs using the articulated finger joints. Our sensors can tell how far away the finger pad is from an object and how much force is exerted on it. We are using sophisticated manipulation visualizations to develop reliable collision worlds that allow motion planning in cluttered spaces. These visualizations allow us to overlay data coming from our perception pipeline with kinematic, grasping, and planning information. Also shown here is our new gantry-based robot, Jacob, that is currently in development. It is based on the Canova Jaco 2 robot, a 6 degree of freedom arm that is compact yet powerful for its lightweight. Augmenting the arm is a z-axis gantry to increase the workspace along the tall shelf, though it has not arrived to our lab yet. Our perception approach utilizes color-based, unsupervised spatio-temporal segmentation and motion-based object verification to accurately build a representation of the bins. Here we track and reconstruct a dense 3D model of the shelf using SDF Fusion. This is achieved by moving the robot arm across the shelf. We detect and calibrate the 6 degree of freedom pose of the shelf in an arbitrary scene by subtracting possible poses of the shelf and finding the best match with the ICP algorithm. The shelf is then tracked with the ICP algorithm while detecting the shape and color outline of the 3D model. We initialize, track, and reconstruct both 2D and 3D models of objects online. The 3D models of the final online reconstructed objects are matched with the known objects in the database, based on the appearance and shape using RGB histograms and point pair features. We send the estimated poses and generated meshes of objects to the robot for grasping. Finally, hundreds of potential graphs are created using a cuboid-based graph generator then filtered using inverse kinematics and collision section. The best candidate grasp is chosen based on approach angle and straight line Cartesian path is calculating in the iterative inverse kinematic calculations. The object is grasped and raised slightly then pulled back in an inverse Cartesian path. 